This is to the established freestyle artists, producers, and managers. To the background dancers and musicians, the promoters, agents, and the DJs. This is to anyone who's ever been able to make even a dime from freestyle music. You've given us your skills, your talents, and your love. But before you go, we need you to give up just one more thing, your knowledge. In this video, we're gonna talk about mentoring the next generation of freestylers and how it can become your ultimate contribution to the genre. So let's go. Hey, freestylers, Latif here, exploring with you the voice, sound, and culture of freestyle music. And every week on this channel, we discuss ways that we, as a freestyle community, can recognize, define, and nurture the culture that lies within the freestyle music genre. We'll also be talking with not only different artists and freestyle personnel, but also some incredible fans in search of ideas that would help us resurrect the genre back to the way we remember it. If you're new to this channel and feel like this is something that you can get down with, do me a favor and smash that like button. And if you click the subscribe and the little bell beside it, every time I upload a new video, you'll be the first to know. Most artists and fans are more or less around the same age. It's that relatability factor that creates the bond between them. It's why certain artists can perform songs that you would swear was written especially for you. It's why major brands would use certain artists to promote their products and services. It's because they share a similar demographic. So what does this have to do with mentoring the next generation of freestyle artists? Well, to be honest, Nothing, except to remind us that we're all more or less around the same age and that when we start to drop, we will start to drop. Artists, producers, managers, agents, fans, what then? As responsible adults, we're concerned about our future because our future usually includes people we love. We buy life and health insurance so that we can ease the stress off of our loved ones in case of a tragedy or major setback. And I know that this similar to might seem a bit strange, but to be honest, this is how I feel about freestyle. You see, I've had a pretty good life. I've lived comfortably, I've taken vacations, what homes, giving my children pretty much anything they've ever wanted, and more importantly, it was through this genre that I met my wife. Some might treat this like some sort of hobby or pastime, but for me, it means much more than that. And I'm not just talking about the music, I'm talking about the culture and everything that it stands for. How can I ever turn my back on it and walk away? How can I ever do anything else? And what it did, not only for the urban Latino youth, but for everyone. How can I not stand up for it, protect it, cherish it? It really, really means that much to me. How can I show it some sort of homage? How can I tell it thank you? What can I give back to it? And how can I make sure that once I'm gone, that it will be okay? Dear artists, producers, managers, agents, promoters, once we check out, what happens to the genre? Can we trust that it will continue to stand? Will people a hundred years from now know anything about it? Will they know the songs, the artists, the legacy? The answer is by mentoring. People from other industries do it all the time. By teaching others, we not only preserve the legacy, but we continue to grow. Every one of us who has benefited from this genre needs to now begin mentoring. That doesn't mean giving up what you do or even retiring, not at all. But find someone that reminds you of your yourself, someone who has that same fire that you had when you first began. They don't need to be a relative or a close friend, and they definitely shouldn't have to pay you. Teach them what you know. Teach them about freestyle, the genre, the culture. Teach them things that you wish you would have known when you first began. Take them to shows, take them to the studio, take them by the hand and walk them through the process. Teach them the classics, teach them the history, teach them to respect the legacy and to protect the integrity and teach them that in 20 years, they should do the same. This is what I mean by mentoring Freestyle's next generation. And I believe that if you do this, that it would be your greatest contribution to the genre. So here's a question for you. Do you feel that by mentoring the next generation of freestylers that it can possibly sustain, maybe even progress the genre? Your answer to this question will become the springboard to many discussions about this topic and eventually and only with your help will we finally be able to discover the voice 
sound, and culture of freestyle. Hey, I really appreciate you watching this video, and if it made any kind of sense to you, that thumbs up will let me know. And if you hit subscribe and the little bell beside it, every time I upload a new video, you'll be the first to know. My name is Latif Mercado, and until next time, keep it real, keep it peace, and remember, freestyle for life! Woo!